what led to you uh, missing practice the last two days before today? Uh, just personal stuff. Uh, I'd rather not speak about, but yeah. Um, after the game on Monday night, uh, Aaron talked about the last play. Um, and you guys said you weren't on the red line and you, you cut in. It was a little more critical from a quarterback publicly than I've heard in my time doing this. Were you upset at all that he, he made that uh, public? No. Uh, I just got to be on the red line. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel like you guys are, are on the same page, you and Aaron? Mike, or do you feel like that's still? Oh, well, we st it's still, you know, building uh, day by day, practice by practice, game by game. Uh, but yeah, we uh, definitely still building. How do, you, how do you feel physically, Mike? I mean, you, you dealt with a, a legitimate injury that you're still coming back from, missed some time at training camp. I mean, do you feel like yourself? Yeah, I'm good. Still... I'm good. How, how do you feel about this group of wide receivers in general now that Devontae's in there and the, the, the potential you guys have? Oh, it's, it's elite. Uh, probably the best, one of the best rooms in the league. Uh, excited to, you know, learn from Tay and everything he's been through in this league and, you know, the receiver that he's been, probably been – Top two, top three uh, in this league for a while. So excited, you know, to learn from him and, you know, pick his brain and some things. Did you and Aaron um, have to talk after Monday night at all about that, that last play and just and, and what he said after the game? Uh, yeah. But I mean, we 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 all watch film. We all go through it and you know make the corrections. So yeah, I mean. Play football. Did he reach out to you? Was it one of those things where he, he talked to you personally one-on-one? -on -one? Yeah.